Welcome back to another vlog. This is the fourth video on calisthenics journey, uh, which means this marks the first month since I started my calisthenics journey, which means it's time for a body check-in. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you guys what my body currently looks like versus the before, which is a month earlier, or in the first video, and we're gonna see if I made any progress towards that goal. As you can see, it may look like I shred a few pounds, hopefully more. You know, I made some progress, and it's not bad. And you shouldn't expect much after one month. Uh, it is a long and arduous journey, uh, something you gotta stay committed and determined on. You know, for the first month, I only focused on working in the training routine, making it a daily habit and a regular, you know, just a regular effort, something I don't have to stress about when I get home. Um, however, I do know that there is another area that I did not really focus on and, and that is a main contributing factor to you know your transformation, which is dieting. I did not want to jump in hardcore, you know, add a training routine and add a strict diet plan because a lot of times what that does is you know it puts a person through too much torment and despair or, or it's just too crazy of a change. We're in it for the long haul and we're going to be doing it for long-term gains and so forth. Uh, so a little bit about the diet. So the goal is to eat more lean, you know, less fatty foods, uh, less bread, no carbs, you know, try to cut out as much rice and bread as you can, anything of that sorts, and uh, especially sugar. Not a lot of people know, but sugar is probably one of the main contributing factors to, uh, you know, just weight gain, keeping you kind of thick, and uh, it's really hard to burn off because, uh, you don't think about it too much. It's sweet and it makes everything better, but the only thing that doesn't make better is your body. So, you know, try to cut that out. I'm gonna do my best to cut that out. I love juice, but I can't, I can't, I can't do it anymore. You know, gotta stick uh, hardcore to this diet starting uh, from this day because I wanna be able to see a much dramatic change uh, by my second month. And, uh, you know, if it works out, I'll, I'm the proof that you needed to cut out sugars and all those other stuff. All right, so let's get this morning training routine started. Uh, my dog's going crazy. I'm gonna hit pull ups, gonna hit push ups, dips, squats, and then I'm gonna add something new, which is the dip uh, leg ups on the dip bars. So uh, let's get started. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna be brutally honest with you right now. Uh, I really didn't wanna do this today. I, I, got, I got up out of bed and I was like, I'm tired. I wanna lay down, I wanna sleep in. I did not wanna work out. Uh, but to be honest, it's days like this 
where you really should do something, uh, if you don't want to do it, it might mean that you really should. And so, force myself to get up, get out, you know, drink some coffee, some pre-workout, get my day started, and jump straight into this calisthenics video. I almost did not make it, and and it makes me look, feel very guilty that I was gonna give up on this so early, so soon. <sighs> but you're stronger than that, I'm stronger than that, and I'm gonna continue to push on because, you know, motivation's not always gonna be there. Uh, but what will be there is your will, your willpower, your drive, your mental focus, you know, it's all about the mind and then it's your body after. So if you can beat it into your mind, your brain, then your body's gonna follow. So that's gonna conclude today's video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, calisthenics journey.